Welcome to the GDSS Nanguno Press Club. Well, Madam Mohammed, over to you. Mr. Prada, is there any government intervention that our school needs urgently? Oh, that is very, very good question. Indeed, when it comes to an old intervention in the school, that would say yes, because the school here has faced with so many things that need to come for an intervention if there is a means. And as such, I would like to state out some of it. If you try to, as in, check it within the parameters of structure, I must say it is not structure at all compared to what some of the school down there in Medugri Metropolitan. And I must say, even there, if there is any in intervention that we need so far so good, if you can observe, we are in a place whereby even lessons are not being taken in a conducive environment because of what? Because of the IDPs within us here. And one of the most of the intervention that I would like maybe the school will look upon is first relocating the IDPs within us here so that we can have a conducive atmosphere for lessons in terms of delivering so that our student will be imparted in the way it should be. And to add more again, I must say the school lacks some amenities that will help the student to learn much again. And one of them is we don't even have a live lottery that will assist our students to go in there to practice. Practical in the sense that it will equip them with knowledge that will enhance them in something to see in the future. So we need live lottery, we need a fence of school, we need these IDPs within us to be relocated to somewhere. So I am urging, if there is a means, I am urging that is an urgent in in intervention that the government need to look upon but we are managing we are managing and with time and time will define it and all these things that have been mentioned good lab lottery and um, fencing of the school because if without the school being fenced the student can just you know stand up one of one one way or the other to just escape without even the school even closed so i will appreciate if this thing will be looked into action and be considered. Thank you. Seeing the population of Monguno as it is now and the total number of our students, are you satisfied with the turnout of our students? If yes, why? And if no, why? Uh, considering the total number of the masses, so to say, and children in Monguno, I must say I am not satisfied with the turn up of the students. And the question you should ask, you said, if I am not satisfied, then what are the reasons? A reason was that I must say the turnout of the school here, I am not okay by it, but I want to make mention of if there is a way whereby the government, the government have tried her own best, if there is a way that, you know, the masses, the parents, or we see the importance of education just like seeing you here coming here to invite and interview me i feel so appreciated because you know the value and as such value if it's not being passed towards to the student out there you can never you can never see intellectual student or intellectual people coming out from a generation of this time so you can you can, you can compare the high number of people in Monguno and yet the percentage of students you see are few. Why? Because there is something which we call what ignorance. And as such must what? As such must come over. If not, they will continue in this, in this, in this way. So I must say it, the turn up of the schools and the turn up of the students, I am not okay by it and I am urging you as an example to what to make an awareness whenever you went to the home and emphasize on how important education is and how important it will be achieved at a time because in everything they said there is a time and once the time is what excluded you will not find value in it so 
the turn up is not okay and I am urging it and it can also be what we can only overcome this when by an awareness is being created within the, the community at large. So I am urging you, you are also in the system, I'm urging you to put the fight or to put what the motion in what in front of us so that we can achieve a total turnover turn of the student among us here. Thank you. Musa, I'm going to go over to you.